uh, and gals that have come in on the third round. So thank you everyone for coming. And you gas stop guys, you need to hush. <laughs> So I know a lot of you guys have already heard all this, but sorry because you're allowed to stay for all the sessions. You get to hear it again. So I do want to say thank you to, for coming and for caring about our veterans just as much as we do. So give yourself a round of applause for that. Thank you so much for stuffing our bucket, paying for the tickets, making donations online. And of course, you have to wait to the very end of this little chat to hear the final total. Um, but before that, we do want to say all of your donations are going to help veterans right here locally in Tampa. All of the tickets, all the donations online, and the bucket in the back. Now, not only that, but we also are getting matched by RV Unplugged. So they are going to do a dollar for dollar match. And that's going to go to home for our troops. But make sure you stick around and pay attention because we have another surprise for you. There's more things in store for our veterans today. It's going to be really amazing. So before we do that, though, I would like to say thanks to RV Unplugged by bringing up our contestants from season one. Whoever is still here, please come on up. They survived season one when we didn't know what we were doing, when we didn't have money to do it, and we were just trying to have fun. So... The GoPros. <laughs> There's a lot of behind the scenes stuff that unfortunately you guys did not get to see, but it was a lot of fun. So I really want to thank you guys for trusting me, not hanging up on me and actually showing up for the show. So thanks for that. And Tony, do you want to say some things? Some things. Hey, I just want to personally thank you all because honestly, RV Unplugged is you all. Right? We're trying to build a community. We're trying to build a show that you guys can be proud of and be able to get behind. And what you're going to see is the, the cast members are going to start becoming more and more just like you. You know, it's not going to be just all about influencers. It's going to be it about good anybody. Looking. Yeah. <laughs> you know, good looking, can't do anything because their knee hurts, you know, stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. Stacy, 100%. This is the last time we get to do this tonight. She is the reason that we have such amazing talent up here because she vets everybody. All right, we have to say goodbye to season one for the final time, but not forever. Bye, friend. All right, so let's welcome season two. Come on up. since not all of them could make it to this event. So there are more in store, and there are a few that, you know, obviously had to go home and take a nap. So I'm really worried about who's going to win because we see who can take it. So, all right, we're going to let them introduce themselves to you. Oh, my gosh. This is such a surprise. I didn't know they wanted us to do this. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Uh, Kevin and Tabitha, uh, we are a retired Navy family. Yeah. Uh, we are full-time. We've been doing it for three years, and uh, we are not influencers, but we're here to win. We are your next champions. Yeah. Very bold. Very bold. Talking smack right from the beginning. I suppose we, too, should claim that we will be season two champs. All right, very good, thank you, very good. Uh, we're Jack and Shelby. We are, uh, we're from Tennessee. Y'all, hey! Yeah, hey, hey. hey, Tennessee. Tennessee in the house, yes. Uh, we, uh, we're full-timers for about a year and a half now, and, um, you know, we're very happy. We are not influencers at all, but we're very influential, and, uh, and we're happy to be. Uh, so smiles, everybody. And, uh, yeah, we hope that we're the winners. That's, that's, uh, no, we are going. <laughs> Hi, we are the Wayward Wags. I am Dustin. This is Leslie. Woo! Woo!
retired arm. We have been on the road for over four years full time now. We travel with our bearded dragon scout. Leslie is a retired DOD civilian. And we are happy to be on season two. And we can't wait to hold up the big check with $25,000 on it. That he is going to have made out. It's so nice for you to hold the check for us. I'm so excited. We did not talk to one of the producers and buy a bag. Right, have you noticed anything? They're not very competitive, are they? No, I don't know how well we did with uh, with picking out the contestants, but we? wait, we? Yeah. <laughs> Look, her, she's gonna stand up here and talk shit too, so <laughs> she has to. All right. All right, wait, I hope I hope Lily went home. Did Lily go home? Okay, that was a three-year-old. Sorry. Okay. All, right. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks so much. We are so looking forward to season two. It's going to be so much fun. All right, thanks, guys. All right, now it's time for some numbers. All right, we got one more thing. I totally forgot. Hold on. We are excited about the money, aren't we? All right. All right, I just want to make a couple quick announcements. This season, and I didn't say this on the first two rounds because I didn't have any rum and coke in me, but this season, <laughs> you all asked for Phil and Stacy to do a little bit more. Yes! Episode one, oh my God. You will not believe what we're going to make them do. I can't tell you right now, but you got to watch. Um, but he has to stay within a certain weight limit. <laughs> And I'm struggling right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm a struggle bus. What's the next stream? Anyways, so we wanted to make sure. We wanted to make sure that you didn't have to be a contestant to win. Right, so if you look around, you see the watch and win. One, one, two. You can see the watch and win thing, right? So any one of you can win things. All of our great sponsors like Gas Stop. Martin, raise your hand. He said, yeah, I want them to be able to win one of our vows, which is a, you gotta have one. You gotta have a Gas Stop valve. It's, it's a safety, it's a life issue. You gotta have one. So if you, if you scan that code, we're gonna have electric bikes giving away a bike. Brooklyn Betty's gonna give away a bed. Right now, you can win two nights at Camp Margaritaville, a season finale rally ticket, a solo stove. So we're gonna keep it on a rotation. You're gonna be able to win things. So you don't have to be on the cast to win big. Awesome. All right. So the other thing we didn't mention is that you, you'll notice this season that it's kind of half and half, half influencers, half regular RVers. And season three is going to be even less influencers, more RVers, because it's all about. Yes. Howard, you can't win. You can't come on. You, maybe if we have like a, a all stars cast, you'll come back. Okay. You're my first pick. Um, but it's it's about RVing and RVers, and we want more of those that are out there doing this day in and day out to have a chance to apply to become a cast member. So now they've made it easy. You can do it online. Tony's got something uh, denned up online that you guys can go to and fill out an application. They'll be vetted, yada, yada, yada. And you could be up here for season three. So just keep that in mind. All right, now it's time to talk numbers. And we have a surprise for you. One of our, a couple of our season two contestants also are big, huge military fundraisers and they have a presentation to make. So Tracy, yeah. If you could come on over, we would like to see you, please. Yeah. We, we have, since we started our YouTube channel almost five years ago, uh, we were very involved in the veteran community back in Fort Benning, Georgia, where we left, where we launched from. 
And we missed that. We missed that veteran community. And so we decided that we would take a portion of everything that we earn on all of our social media platforms and we would donate it to veteran organizations. We've been doing that for the last four years since we've been traveling on the road and we have donated over $45,000 to veterans. <laughs> trying to catch up to them. Uh, we had an event a couple of nights ago um, and we raised over a thousand dollars. Can we get Chris and Katrina from Our Everyday Getaway and Ken yeah! and Cam from the yeah. Rosemiths to come up here with us? We had an event a couple of nights ago with uh, the Rosemiths for Ken and Pam, Our Everyday Getaway, Chris and Katrina, Lawrence and Natalie from the Brazen Brits, Larry and Alice from Downsizing Makes Sense and uh, Joel and Tanya from This Is Our Adventure. We raised over $1,000. And we already had enough to make our next donation as just the Wayward Wag. So we took that money and we added it to the money that we raised on Wednesday night. And so tonight we are gonna donate to the Elks National Foundation so that you guys can disperse those funds. So tonight we are gonna donate a check to you guys for $6,150. Wow. money so this is gonna go way far to help the veterans in the Tampa community and we could not do this without you guys we have some Wagsters yeah. some of yeah. our insiders Woo! in the audience so this is a big portion of where we get our funds thank you guys so much for supporting us and for supporting our veterans yeah. and thank you to Phil and Stacy for putting this event on tonight we couldn't have done it without you guys also. She's like, oh, I didn't check my hair. <laughs> I didn't check mine either. Right here is why the community is such a great community. Like-minded people coming together for a great cause, no matter who it is, what the call is. You guys have answered the bell, you've shown the wags that, you've shown us that, and we're going to continue to contribute to that number. And Stacy is gonna make it wait a little bit longer because we, we've got some other stuff to give out. Then we'll give you the final number. So the last color band was blue. Check blue bands, blue bands. Do you have a, a X on your band? If you do, come on, come on up here. Woo. There he is. Yeah. A recipient of a new hat and an emergency magnet. Yeah. All right, now for the grand total of what the event tonight was about. Um, and Stacy's got some holy. <laughs> Some numbers to go over. Let's just say we beat last year. No! All right, so you guys, everyone here in this room, raised six thousand two hundred forty-five dollars wow. and fifteen cents. This is all going to the Elkhorns Tracy Dash for y'all, which means Homes for Our Troops is getting six thousand two hundred forty-five dollars and fifty cents from our Van Club. This is why we do our channel. It's for people like you, for the community, and for our veterans. You guys know it means the world of us to us. And to know it means just as much to you guys. It just, I never dreamed in my wildest dreams when we set out on the road that day that I would meet all of you wonderful people and we would be able to do so much for the people we love. So, thanks guys. <laughs> Anybody got a tissue? 
we might need it. And, and truly, yeah, I need it. My nose is running. Um, we, we truly mean that. And we've been asked over and over the last few days if we thought we would be where we are today with the channel and what we've done for the community. And the answer is always no. And just so you know that we also tell people that if our channel went away tomorrow, we would still bang the drum for our veterans. Yeah. 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 And that's what this is all about. It's, it's not about us. We have a voice, we have a platform. Every time we ask of you, you answer the call. Gas Stop's been a huge supporter of us from day one. Um, and love you guys. We, we just, <laughs> thank you, Martin. We absolutely love the response that we get. Um, and it's not, you know, when we ask these questions or we ask for these donations, it's not for us. You know, every single penny that was raised here is staying here in Tampa, and that's a beautiful thing. Um, so again, we thank you. We hope that you guys are mingling and, and making those connections so that when you're out there on the road, the community is alive and well, and you make these, these lasting connections, and they just keep going and going. So again, we appreciate you coming. Thank you very much.